Poof. Oh, fucking steak ski bone. Fucking game bone. Yeah. Oh, just show We're you. on the East Coast. We're in New Hampshire. Okay. And so what? Then the plane stays, huh? Yeah, so the plane just stays there. Because, yeah, we, let's go. Um, I need to call this guy before we're on the plane. He's, they're selling a portfolio of treatment centers. How are you, sir? Hey, I'm very well. How are you? I'm doing fantastic. It's a pleasure to meet you. I've heard your name uh, many times in a positive light over the years. And you so as well. You happy, as well. Yeah, happy to connect. So what's going on? Oh, brother, I um, I sold my business uh, December 21st, so maybe almost two months ago. And okay. now I- Congratulations. Thank you, yeah, I appreciate it. We had a, a great outcome and, um, you know, they bought 100% of, of the business. And so that left me kind of a soldier without a war, if that makes sense. Right, right. And, um, you know, so looking at, at doing it again, um, you know, I'm looking at some real estate opportunities in different states to build them and, and also have an appetite to acquire and buy. Driver. Yeah, it's like a PTSD thing. Like if anything goes wrong, I'm in my best tactical position. Strange, right? I know. If yeah. I need to take control of this vessel, yeah. seatbelt. <laughs> it's crazy. Looking at a piece of real estate that is a healthcare facility um, in an undisclosed location, <laughs> Area 51. But looking at starting a uh, another addiction treatment facility out here. Hey, John, Eric Spoffer. Eric? Pleasure to meet you. Absolutely. You're much more handsome than your picture on LinkedIn. <laughs> <laughs> well, we'll have to do, redo that, you know? That's all right. Um, what do you want to see first? Do you want to talk or you want to just take a look? Or? <sighs> Give me the tour. Let's talk and walk. Well, this is the lobby, obviously. Yeah. Okay. How was the flight? It was good. To the gym and you'll see the, some of the mechanical stuff and then we'll go to the different wings. Um, this, so this, how many different wings are there's there? There's six. There's one, two, three, four, five, six? Yeah, and, and the original was just these four here. Uh, Understood. Sub subjugated off, so it'll go down through here, but we, we designed that to uh, be a connector hallway, and basically this whole area over here is about 90% ready to go. This one. It's honestly, it's kind of deja vu because I was doing this in 2015. Anyway, Let's check we'll it out. This way. We'll go down this way. Uh, we'll get that later. Yeah, we'll stay out for a second. Got it. Okay. In a full size kitchen. Uh, just a game room. You'd put some carpet in here to soften it up a little You'll bit. See, the other units look a lot nicer than this one. Okay, yeah, all right. But we, don't, we didn't do carpet per se, but uh, there's some, there's some But just, I'm looking at it and it's very institutional, which is great from a compliance and safety yeah. and all of that. But how do you soften it up a little bit aesthetically? Like I said, you'll, this is the worst one. Yeah, so, that's not bad. Yeah. And this one, that's yep. the way it was designed. Um, so we use and so this is the nursing station for two units. Yeah, yeah. So tell me about the area where we are. This is a popular, I'm not very familiar, this is my first time. And so are we in a middle class neighborhood, lower middle class? Right here, we're in, we're in the hood, boy. <laughs> <laughs> I feel safe enough here, but I can handle myself. <laughs> yeah, you can. <laughs> I'm gonna be the kitchen. Okay. So how bad were those gang kids? 
Ah. They weren't any worse than any other kids. I, I coached uh, high school for 25 years, or white or whatever, one-on-one. Uh, -on -one, if you treated them like humans, they yep. were fine. Yep. So it's going to move all the crap out. This, uh, this is wireless-based. Yeah, cloud-based stuff. With, with the 360 cameras and the, all that, and we just kind of ran out of money and yeah. and hope. <laughs> there's there's some of my gallery here of people stealing shit from us. <laughs> <laughs> but this this dude was working in my kitchen here, and uh, I caught him stealing those. Those are chicken tenders. <laughs> this guy here. This guy broke into the <laughs> So he made the wall of shame. Yeah. There's some fucking chicken fingers. <laughs> he goes, uh, he, he says, <laughs> I said, John, I, I didn't do that. And I said, Robert, what's in your hand? He says, oh, I just taking some trash out. And I said, you want to see the rest of the film where you were cooking the chicken fingers and all that kind of thing? Oh, my God. But uh, the guy in the red, he... he they were in tight ship. You have no idea. Yeah, yeah, he did. This, this Not guy, only did you catch guy, him uh, cooking some chicken fingers and taking it out of here, he ended up I memorialized. Him after he went, uh, anyway, we, after 14 years, I guess, we got a lot of stories. Yeah, okay. So, uh, Josh, we, we were interested in the, um, I know you told us that you were in the middle of building a fish treatment center now. Correct. Okay. And you have experience building one in the past? Yes. Used to stamp all of our drawings. Touring one uh, facility while talking to an architect of, about uh, another facility. All by tasking. Because I think for this particular project, right, it's got a good shell and the layout may work. Um, but I think that there's definitely going to be... Um, this has been great. We need to go to keep our schedule, but uh, well, this, this is the this is the tail end. Yeah, this is the gist of it. I, I understand the property at this point to the best extent that I'm going to today. Going. Sir, coming I appreciate okay, it. Yeah. It's a pleasure to meet you. There we go. Thank you. Yeah, look, uh, I'm like, who this? Why y'all tripping off who this? Why y'all looking so clueless? Why you acting like I don't do this? Hold up. Just going to see the facility, you know what I mean? Found it, looking at it, digesting it, trying to see the vision of what it looks like now, but what it could be, the potential of it, right? And, um, and so, spent some time out there, now I'm getting a goddamn sandwich because we're hungry. facility out in the Midwest, Lori conducting business calls, <laughs> uh, and then we're going to go get a workout in. A lot of times the workouts are multitasking. It's returning emails, it's texts, it's I talk on the phone a lot when I work out, thank God for AirPods. I'm constantly making strategic calls and, and just out there kind of throwing it. Uh, but it's also a sacred time for me kind of like therapy to, to work that stuff out and making time for it. I get a lot of ideas um, and creativity flows during my workouts and so it's important to make time for that. All right, I'll see you tomorrow. Awesome, cool. Awesome guys, thank you. See you.